Ashes tour, the first part, we're doing the uh, inspection of the Morgan. This is a 1939 Morgan Series 144 Le Mans version that was uh, first registered on the 3rd of August 1939 uh, as a 21st birthday present for an An Lang. Uh, there will be a hundred of course this year. And, um, it's modelled on a car that uh, a lady, Felicity Fawcett, I think it was, I think I got it slightly wrong, um, took part in Le Mans in the previous year in 1938. So as a 21-year-old girl who'd probably been reading the papers and seen what uh, this lady had managed to achieve in a Morgan the year before, she probably thought it was a good idea to have one as well. Probably also helped that she was a personal friend of the Morgan family, Peter Morgan at the time, who was the uh, um, son of the founder, and um, and so she probably had sort of their family had access to get uh, to get a car such as this. Um, the car was um, used; it, she probably used it in a frugal way during the war because she wouldn't have had access to petrol. And then the next time it crops up is in about 1949, when Les Huxham or Joe, Lucky Joe Huxham, was racing it, and he was a Morgan dealer in Bournemouth, and he had a, a series of cars, and um, uh, this was one of them, uh, and he took part in it between about 1949 and 1952. So, uh, quite a lot of history there. Right, so, okay, door. man with a gammy leg gets into... Man with a gammy leg getting into an old car. So we'll put the uh, contact in here. We will give it some choke, we'll give it a touch of electricity. That's the fuel pump charging up the SU carburetor. Got that. Restart. Run. Now it's going to get warm before we go. We've got a bit of an ignition light on. Can't get out. Oh, 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 bent my, bent my leg last thing. <laughs> Library, I think it's like. Right turn to Library. Hold tight. Here we go. It's about remembering who we were before they told us who we were supposed to be. An opportunity to pursue our passions. 
for me, it's my photography and going on this adventure around Europe, exploring opportunities in videography. For Christopher, my brother, clearly judging by the smile on his face as he drives his Morgan through the Cotswold countryside, it's his pleasure uh, involved in his passion with old cars. For others on this journey I'm going to meet, it's wine and the exploration of fine wine. For others maybe it's a second home in Italy. It's all about finding our passion and the opportunities that early retirement affords us. It's an interesting time, and one we've really got to embrace.